Some accuse the Bible of being a collection of myths and legends written by well-intentioned humans. By contrast, the Bible says that it is the Word of God who cannot lie. If the Bible was authored by God, it should be like no other book ever written. For example, when it mentions scientific matters, what it says should be in harmony with proved science. When it foretells the future, those prophecies should come true 100% of the time. And if the Bible contains God's message to mankind, it should be available no matter where a person lives and no matter what is done to stop its distribution. Is the Bible full of myths or is it accurate? Consider just some of the evidence indicating that the Bible is truly an extraordinary and trustworthy book. During the time when the Bible was written, many people had mistaken ideas about the shape of the earth. A theory written after the Bible was completed was that the universe emerged from a cosmic egg and that the earth is supported by various creatures. In contrast, about the year 1473 BCE, Moses wrote that the earth is suspended upon nothing. And around the year 732 BCE, the prophet Isaiah wrote that the earth is a circle or sphere. These Bible writers contradicted ideas that were popular at the time. It was some 200 years after Isaiah's day that the Greek philosopher Pythagoras may have proposed that the earth is a sphere and more than 3,000 years passed from Moses' writing until scientists such as Isaac Newton realized that the Earth seemed to hang upon nothing. No human can foretell the future in exact detail. Yet about the year 732 BCE, the prophet Isaiah foretold that a man named Cyrus would conquer the mighty city of Babylon that he would dry up a river, and that he would enter the city through open gates. History confirms that every detail of this prophecy was fulfilled. Concerning the same city, the prophet Jeremiah foretold that Babylon would become piles of stones and never again be inhabited. Despite its strategic location, Babylon eventually became a pile of stones and remains that way. Throughout history, powerful men have tried to stop the distribution or translation of the Bible. They burned at the stake those who translated it into common languages and persecuted those who read it. The Bible has weathered the most sustained attack of any book in history, yet it has become the most widely translated and published book of all time. Billions of copies have been produced in some 2,700 languages. The Bible is scientifically accurate, contains reliable prophecy, and is available to all mankind. You have good reason to believe that it is inspired by Jehovah, the God who cannot lie. Still, you may ask, who is the author of the Bible? What is the Bible about? How can you understand the Bible? Those questions are answered in Lesson 3 of the brochure, Good News from God. You can download a copy from jw.org. Jehovah's Witnesses will be happy to study the Bible with you. Fill in the online request for a Bible study, and a witness in your area will call to discuss the Bible at a time and place convenient for you.